Hello, it's good to be coming with you again today on this broadcast. Thank you so much for tuning in. I want to talk to you from Exodus chapter 3. The background on this chapter is that Moses uh, act, was, was in Egypt's court. He was in a high-ranking officer, and he saw an Israelite being mistreated, and he killed this man, and because of that, he had to flee to, the, to Mount Oreb, or the mountain of God, on the back side of the desert. And uh, the Lord told him in this particular chapter 3 that he was standing on holy ground. And that is holy ground, been for years, the land of Israel and the land that Moses had went to. He was on the back side of the desert, and he's, he, heard, he saw a bush burning, and he didn't know what this bush was. And he turned around to see, well, what is this that I've been looking at? And I can't understand what's going on here. And he looked at that bush and the Lord spoke to him out of that bush. And he said, Moses, Moses. He called his name two different times to get his attention and be sure that he understood. This was God speaking to him through a burning bush. Now, God speaks to us in various ways, and we never know just exactly what God is doing all the time. But there with this, then God told him that he was standing on holy ground to take his shoes off because of standing on holy ground. And he went on to say in that particular chapter, uh, that I am the Lord God of Abraham and Isaac and Jacob. And I said, I will surely see the affliction of the people that's going on in the land of Egypt, and I've come to deliver them, and I'm going to send you to deliver them. And then, of course, Moses, he said, you know, I'm, I kind of have a speech impediment. I can't speak real good. I'm not going to be able to do that. And God, of course, said, yes, you can, because I'm going to be with you. And, you know, it's interesting to see how God speaks to us. God spoke through a burning bush, and he's going to send Moses over to talk to Pharaoh, and eventually the people are going to be able to get out of Egypt because Moses intervened and went over there and, and helped the Israelites get out, and they put the door blood on the doorpost, and they were just delivered that night out of uh, Egypt and fled into the promised land. And you know, that's a wonderful thing because it always says in the Word of God that God is a great provider, and I'm glad to tell you today that God can speak to you in various ways. Uh, just remember that God wants to be with you today. If you'll ask him to be with you, he works miracles. He does miracles so great. And thank you for listening to the broadcast today. In Jesus' name, amen.